Good morning, everybody. I'm supposed to be a blessing. This is my reading for my Scorpios. Look at that, Scorpio. You showed up in your own reading. That's a beautiful death card right there. All right, y'all. Look at that. Anyway, before I get into your reading, please take a moment to like and subscribe to my channel. Please take the... Please take the bell. Please ring the bell so you'll know when I upload videos. And also... If you want to leave me a comment, please do so in the comment section down below. But anyway, y'all show in your own reading. Let's get into this reading, Scorpios. Let's see what's going on with you guys. Alrighty here. What is this? Four of Pentacles. So the Four of Pentacles is saying that some of you could be holding on to your finances a little bit too tight or something here. Some of you are feeling stuck in regard to a situation. So maybe you're feeling kind of stuck in regard to your finances. Maybe something's not going too well with your finances here and you're feeling kind of stuck. You have the Three of Swords. So some of you are dealing with some heartache here. But with the strength card coming up right behind it saying that you dealt with this heartache already. I'm thinking that it was in the past. Somebody did something to you in the past and you dealt with it. Mm, look at this string card. Go ahead on. The string card is also the Leo card. This is beautiful. You dealt with that already. And now you're looking on the horizon for something better to come in. And it's definitely coming in. You know why? Because I see that you have the... Mm -hmm, you're going to have some good times coming in here with the Three of Cups right here. They should have had three women on. Why the hell they got two? But anyway, let me look at this card for a minute. Yeah, that's three of cups. It should have three people, don't you think? Or three cups or three something. But anyway, y'all, let me I get lost in the car. But anyway, you have the six of cups here as well. So when the six of cups comes in the reading, it talks about nostalgia. It's talking about pleasant childhood memories. It can represent remembering something happy from the past. It's reconnecting with old friends or simply a desire to feel like a child again. But see, the bigger... That's a beautiful figure. Look how they made her. I love this deck, y'all. Look how them things coming out of her face. But anyway, it's about reminiscing of the past. You could be thinking about, about thinking about an ex. Ex could be thinking about you. It's what it's doing. That's what's going on. I see a new beginning here. So maybe yeah, you're going to reconnect with somebody from the past here because this is a new beginning card. This going to have a lot of celebrations going on. But like I said, you showed up in your own reading. So you're definitely in your own element, Scorpio. Once again, Scorpios, you could be holding on to your finances a little bit too tight. This could have you kind of feeling kind of stuck because maybe there's something that you want to do in regards to something that's going on with your finances. Some of you could have dealt with some heartache here in the past, but you didn't got your strength together. This is in the past because your back is to this, so you didn't dealt with this situation already. And you're waiting on the rise for something new to come in. You're waiting for something to come in. Something, somebody, some something. There's going to be celebrations here, and you're thinking about the past. You think about somebody, and they probably think about you as well. Ace of Cups is about new beginnings, and Scorpio, they is. And this is an ending card as well, even though it's Scorpio. With endings, they always come new beginnings. Hello, somebody. Thank y'all. Please like and subscribe, comment to my channel.